Yeah, the unemployment rate for our point is uh, 10.3, which is right now is a little bit higher than what is uh, what the state at national average is. The state is, is a little bit below 9 right now, 9.3%. The high point was more known for the furniture market. If you look downtown or if you look up, uh, our whole downtown was just totally tailored toward the furniture market and the furniture industry. So with the downside and the going away of that, it's, it impacted us a lot heavier than it did some of the other counties in the state. The shelter is an environment for individuals who, uh, for the most part, has hit their bottom. There's roughly 72, 76 beds uh, in the regular dorm. During the winter, we have an overflow of individuals, upward of 100 plus individuals. Yes, the economy has had a profound impact on uh, the number of people and the age of the individuals that, uh, that are coming to the shelter. You have a new group of homelessness. We have individuals in our uh, facility right now who are as young as 18 years old. You have to create a want in that individual and allow that person to seek out employment, knowing that they have gained the, the mechanics of doing so. And that's what we're trying to pull. I want to say it's like a family, but it, it, we, we are a business. We're, we're a business of changing lives. Uh, I'm a cabinet maker by trade, do a lot in the furniture, so on and so forth. As the jobs left and went overseas, it became tougher and tougher and more difficult and more difficult. Uh, right now I'm in a program called uh, Cassell Transitional. It's really a shame. It's almost like it's a dying art. It's, uh, you know, it's, uh, it's a real shame. I've seen men who work 30 and 40 years for a company uh, mm -hmm. lose everything they have. Just what a pleasure it's been to associate with folks here at Open Door. Uh, two years ago, I was unemployed and unemployable. You know, today I'm on the board at Open Door. <laughs>